times change. Faces change. But the fire still burns. The culture still remains. And the goal is still the same. Are you with us? Are you all in? We lock in and we're worried about ourselves. Um, we get lost in it and play it hard, man. We're, we're going to be a, a very good team. Uh, the coach, he has a, a way of making sure that we're prepared, that we're ready to go. And like we always say, I think we're the only team that can beat us. You know, when we get stuck with beating ourselves in turnovers and not getting back and not rebounding, uh, 20 games in, I think we've done a good job with being who we are. Olenek, a dagger. We don't play to lose, ever. We don't do anything. We don't practice losing habits. And um, that's why it's so great to be here. Everything we do from shoot around to walking on the plane, this is a business trip. We talked about it, um, and our job ain't over yet. We got one more to win. Um, we better get over this one uh, fairly quickly because we got another good team who hasn't lost at home. I'm in Boston. Uh, you know, study them on the plane, study them tomorrow, and get ready to rock. Butler and Miami continue their business trip. Didwin with two seconds left. Shoots the three. It's over. Miami holds on and wins. The Heat score the last ten points of the game and defeat the Nets here in Brooklyn. It's a steal by Butler. Butler drives a chance. Butler to the rescue. And now there are just three unbeaten teams left at home in the NBA. Every missed nine games in a row, but as he played well in his four games back. And last night, Toronto so very strong with great defense and with 11 of his 17 points in the fourth quarter. And how about this? No turnovers in his 35 impactful minutes. Winslow and McGee, both big winners with late game heroics last night in Toronto. Jimmy Butler on your side, you have a chance. Butler with seven points. Miami with its biggest lead of this first quarter, 24 to 16. He loves using that left-hand dribble, doesn't he? Pulls it back a lot like Dwayne Wade used it to create space and be able to knock down that jump shot. Jalen Brown does the same. Jalen Brown, six points, two for seven shooting. A man who's shooting 49% of the season. That basket should count for Butler, the drive, the jam, and a Celtics foul.